Rockways, Jake Weinberg. Jake, you really uh, lit it up in the second half. After really what was an ugly offensive first half for both teams, what was the message at halftime that uh, Coach gave you guys? Uh, Coach told us to just keep moving the ball and attacking. He said we were pretty stagnant the first half. And he said just keep getting it in the, in the zone. It was really open. So he said just attack and then dish it out or go up and get the layup. Uh, well, you hit a couple of three-pointers. How, uh, how nice was that for you to get into some sort of rhythm there from the outside? You know, it's very nice. I like to hit a couple threes and then get in the groove, and that makes me feel good, makes teammates feel good. And it just gets us in a flow and then just keep going on for there. Talk about the defensive effort. Uh, you know, you held them to, what was it, 30, I don't even know if it was 30 points, uh, something like that. But just talk about the defensive effort. Uh, well, coach tells us to focus on defense a lot. Without our defense, we wouldn't be able to be the offense team that we are. But uh, it's just we stress defense a lot at practice, and then we just hope we execute it during games. Rockway seems to have a tradition of playing low-scoring games in this building. So were you kind of comfortable playing a low-scoring game tonight, or would you have rather seen more points? Well, more points the better, right? But, <laughs> but uh, this year we've had a lot of high-scoring games, so it's kind of different. But, I mean, we've been used to it, so it's not too different. So I'm uncomfortable with it, yeah. Uh, how important, even though you lost the game, taking Elk County Catholic to overtime in the AML semifinals, you guys had kind of been up and down towards the end of the season. Was that a little bit of a confidence booster for you guys? Yeah, definitely a confidence bo booster. Uh, we faced a lot of adversity going in, people saying that we're going to lose by 30, 40, and we went in there talking to overtime. We had a chance to win at the buzzer, but it's still good to bring a good team like Elk County to overtime and come up a little short. But yeah. uh, You guys seemed like you were more physical than Keystone tonight. Did you feel that out on the court? Yeah, I felt like that. I felt we were very physical. Uh, talk about Jarrett and, and the offensive rebounds and what that meant to you guys early on. Jarrett's a huge help. Without Jarrett, we wouldn't be able to get half the boards we get. And I, he needs to work on finishing a little bit. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Jarrett's great with rebounding. Well, Jake, thanks. Congratulations and good luck against Ridgeway. Thank you. Thanks, sir.